I want to thank you all for coming here today to the Nevada Women's Expo. This is my small business, and that's why I invited you here, is because small businesses have difficulty when their government overreaches. One of the overreaches that we found as small business people is that we were hoping that things would change in Washington, D.C. after all the years of promises, and they have. We wanted tax reform, permanent tax relief, and the elimination of government debt that will hurt our children and our grandchildren even more than we're hurting today. Mark Amaday recently voted for a $3.1 trillion budget and tax bills that did none of those things. It is a complete abandonment of Nevada. He did all the wrong things and then he likes to laugh and joke about it, but it's not funny. Mark Amaday did not fix a thing. We all have to go through the same manufactured crisis again in September. He voted to increase spending $143 billion more over last year. He increased the national debt without limits, and he didn't even read the bill. You can't read 2,300 pages in 24 hours. Mark Amaday's vote for this bill will hurt you and it will hurt your children by borrowing against our future. National debt is paid by everyone. It's time for an honest discussion about the promises that have been made and the promises that have been broken. I'm ready to debate these issues with Mark. We can have a friendly discussion so that all the voters of Northern Nevada who have to make this decision can understand what this race is really all about. If you want these broken Washington, D.C. promises to stop, then go to SharonAngle.com. Thank you all for being here, and now I'll take questions.